Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video we will learn um, about deleting data from database in C# -sharp, uh, window forms. So if I show you this uh, Zem control panel, so we have started the Apache server as well as my SQL, and now if I go to this browser and if I show you this table, so we will delete uh, some data from this std table. So for that I will come here to this uh, form and first I will go here to toolbox and here I'll drag in a button so I'll drag it uh, right here and now I'll go to its properties so I'll click on this and properties and now I'll change this to delete and now uh, if I run this uh, application right now so now it is running so i'll read this now we have these records so i'll uh, uh, select a record here um, i'll double click on it or single click um, and then we will click on this delete and uh, we will delete that record so now for that i will go here into um, our code so i'll close it down and to this delete now as we know we already get this um, the selected uh, row uh, and the selected column in our previous tutorial and the code is right here this one from the data grid view so i'll copy this and now i'll go here and i will paste it here so it will get a selected id uh, the selected row ID and now we will go to uh, down here and here we will write our code first is the connection string so I'll go to the top and I'll copy the connection connection string from here this is the connection string I'll copy this and now I'll uh, go down if you do not know about uh, uh, connection connection string so uh, watch the past tutorial of this series so now here we will create the connection so my schedule connection and uh, my schedule connection is not uh, found by default uh, in uh, eShop or in visual studio you have to install its uh, drivers and you can also find that in the first tutorial of this series so new my schedule connection and now here i'll use con string and now i'll use this and semicolon now we have to open the connection so con dot open and now i'll put here semicolon and then we will uh, use my schedule command it it is also already showing us that what to do so equals new uh, my schedule command and uh, now it takes uh, two things one is the query and the other is the connection so we have the connection but we do not have the query so i'll write the query here so query is equal and uh, delete from um, std table we are id equals and here we will use plus and we will get this cell value cell value this is our id which is which we are getting from um the data grid view if you do not know about how to do this you can go into our previous tutorial uh, updating uh, updating data in database and uh, you can now this head how we get this uh, cell value id now uh, i'll pass in here the query and then the connection and now we are good to go so i'll use end and uh, i equals um cmd dot execute non query mm, 
non query and now we will put this in semicolon and now if i is um, greater than minus one and then we'll use this message box dot row data successfully deleted and now all put semicolon now we will run this application now we will read records now as we have read so i want to delete this one as it is selected so if i delete this data successfully deleted so now uh, i have deleted this uh, number seven record so if i read it again now you can see number seven is missing from here now i want to delete this number eight record so if i click on this delete data successfully deleted and then if i read it again now you can see number eight is also uh, deleted so i think that's all for today i hope you like the video if you like the video please like subscribe and comment thank you